Well, I decided to go ahead and do it. I got one of those Intel PC sticks and a 40 inch 4K TV to use as my monitor. Um, for some reason my camera doesn't want to focus real well. But uh show you kind of what it looks like when it's starting up here. Just press the button on the stick in the back. There it comes popping up. Figured this would be a good way to uh, have multiple screens up while I'm working on my schoolwork. I can have a TV show going in the background or have it full screen if um, I'm in the mood to take a break from the schoolwork for a while and just watch some TV. I got the one with the M3 processor and no operating system and uh, I tried starting off with uh, Windows or uh, start, start off with the Ubuntu Linux uh, first and um, there were some things that I needed to do uh, well wanted to be able to hook up my Garmin uh, Ant USB stick so I could use this as my monitor for my bicycle trainer as well and uh, just couldn't find a good way of doing or good software to use with that on on Linux. Uh, I think the the ant stick would have worked fine but uh, I didn't like the the trainer software that was available so I downloaded and installed uh, Windows 10 Pro off of a USB drive which I put into a hub here and you can see that's that's the uh, PC stick it it's a little bit bigger than a USB drive but not not hugely and speed is not bad at all And it is awesome for doing my schoolwork, writing, you know, doing documents. Or uh, it's not a terribly powerful processor, so I probably won't do video editing with it. Um, but it's uh, it's very nice. Uh, show you what uh, streaming looks like on it here. I'll pause the video for a moment. Okay. So, I am doing it in a oh, window right now. Let's see what it looks like in full screen. Don't quite get the 4K definition out of that, but I don't think the movie was ever released in that high of definition to begin with. As you can see, it has no trouble at all streaming. And that was a big part of what I had planned to do. It also has a feature um, it, you can download from Intel's website where you can use your smartphone as the controller for the um, for the PC stick, compute stick, I think they call it. 
which would be great for using it as a home theater PC. Anyway, I just thought I'd give a quick view. I am I'm quite happy with it, and uh, once I get the you know, a real power machine in here, I probably will move it to our uh, larger screen in the living room. 